first time. Same thing that brought me the first time. I've come to look after the bank's children. Us? Oh, yes, you too. I wanted to pay great tribute to the first film because it means so much to me. And I, in a way, wanted to protect it. That's because the 1964 Mary Poppins was the first film a four-year-old Rob Marshall had ever seen. Directing Mary Poppins Returns was daunting. I use myself as a barometer. What would I want to see? You know, if I came to see a Mary Poppins sequel, and I'd want to see a live-action animation sequence, for instance, hand-drawn the way it was originally, and, and I would want to see a big athletic production number like, you know, we have with Trip Little Light Fantastic. There were things that I felt were in the DNA of Mary Poppins that needed to remain. Did you have to twist any arms to get cast? This is a dream cast, and it was, and everybody I asked said yes. I know, I remember Meryl Streep saying to me when she said yes, I want to be part of sending a movie like this out into the world now. And so that was, that was true of everybody, including Dick Van Dyke, who came on board to be with us, which was just a dream come true. He was 91 when we shot it. He's 92 now. He lifted our set, I can't tell you, like just through the roof. I mean, he said to me when he walked on the set, he turned to me and said, I have to tell you something, Rob. I feel the same spirit here as I did on the first film. And for me, that was the greatest compliment ever. Speaking of compliments, Marshall has one for our town. It's just such a great city, you know? I, I've played there as an actor, as a performer, yeah. In what? Well, two things, with a chorus line mm -hmm. and um, also uh, Zorba. That was my first Broadway show that toured before we came to Broadway. I was a dancer, you know, started as a dancer. And now the go-to movie Disney musical director. Marshall has been tapped to direct a live action, The Little Mermaid, teaming again with Lin-Manuel Miranda, who is co-writing the music. Janet Davies, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.